hi guys lens here in this video i am going to show you how to fix the error 403 with your iphone so if you are having this problem by any means it can be that you have an expired certificate or something like that for your phone so you want to go over to settings this is the first thing you want to try and when you're in setting here you want to scroll down until you see general you go to general and you go to software update you want to ensure that your phone is up to date to the latest iOS version. That's the first thing you want to do. If you are encountering the problem with Safari, right? I'm going to show you what you can do to fix this issue. When you go on Safari, you're getting that error. You want to go to your settings. You want to look for Safari. So let's go here and what you want to do here is that you want to scroll down and you want to clear history and website data so you clear the history and you clear the website data ensure that you will lose all search history from previously and the app will be reset so you want to go to your app store ensure whatever apps you are having this problem on ensure that it is updated the other thing that you will need to make sure if you're still having this problem ensure that your time and date and year is correct if you're still having this problem you want to head over to settings and you want to go to general you want to go to reset transfer or reset iphone here you want to click reset you want to do a network reset so you reset your network you put in your passcode and then you do a network reset If for some reason you are still having this problem, you want to do a factory data reset. When you do this, you will lose all the data on your phone. So you go back to reset and you do reset all settings. So guys, you reset all settings. This will reset all the settings on your iPhone. If that did not work, you want to go and erase all content and settings on the phone and it should come back as brand new all those tips mentioned should fix the issue if you're still having that problem then you want to put your phone into recovery mode you want to connect your phone to a pc computer and you want to restore and update your phone via itunes so i hope that this was helpful you let me know in the comment section if it was and if it was do like share and subscribe also drop a comment down below i'll see how i can help you guys out